This video was sponsored by Coffee. Drink responsibly. All right, people. Welcome to another Pokemon video. Today we are opening the God Box, the brand new Maridon and Coridon. Is that his name? Not really sure. But the brand new Maridon and Coridon Scarlet and Violet Treasure Chest Lunchbox Tin, whatever you want to call it. We got our usual little coffee, and in the back we got the pizza. My stomach is waiting for me to be done with this video so I can enjoy the pizza, but I think I'm gonna enjoy opening this a little bit more. As you can see though, when the store probably got the box full of tins, they probably just sliced the box right through this. So thank God I'm not a sealed collector cause there's like a big scratch on the tin and the thing is like open. So if you're a sealed collector, always keep an eye out for these little things like that. Since it's already cut for us, let's open it by there. And there's a big reason why I bought this tin. As you can see here, that's everything that's inside, but we're gonna see this in a second. But as I was saying, there's a big reason why. Let me show the back first and the sides. All right, I keep interrupting myself, but there's a big reason why I bought this in the first place. Usually I don't buy these kinds of tins unless they're like really cheap, but I've watched a lot of people open these on YouTube and apparently every single Silver Tempest pack has a hit in it. So I wanted to see for myself if this was true or not. So. That's why I bought this in the first place. But first thing we see is these beautiful promos. But as you can see, these are not promos. They're from the Paldea Evolve set, as it says right here. And there's no Black Star promo logo. But we got some exclusive holographic cards that are definitely gonna go in the binder. And it comes with a... Who's, po who's that Pokemon? Oh, it's a uh, Maridon, I think. Yeah, we got a Maridon or Coridon coin. I've sold a lot of Pokemon coins this week on Facebook Marketplace. So if you don't really use these, keep them aside and put them in a lot and list them on Facebook Marketplace. Someone will buy them. All right, so here we got our three promos sleeved up. Looking nice. Here we have a little code card for y'all. And let's go let's see what kind of packs we got in here. We got one Scarlet and Violet, one Paldea Evolved, two Paldea Evolved. We got another Scarlet and Violet, and I believe two Silver Tempests. Yep. There we go, looking nice. Let's put that aside. Nice pack selection in my opinion. And another reason why I bought this chest is because it comes with six packs and it only cost me $30, which I don't know for you guys in the United States or other countries, but in Canada, that's a really good price because a pack usually costs like 550. So we got some nice value in packs. And what else we got in here? We got some stickers that I can add on my fridge. As you can see, there's a couple of them right there. <laughs> so that's not going in the trash we got some more stickers more stickers a bunch of them and we got a tiny little binder that probably gonna give to the thrift store because i'm not gonna use this and we got a big piece of plastic and to finish it off we got a little lunch box for like the kids fuck them kids all right, I would probably usually open the Silver Tempest first because it's the oldest set, but I'm gonna keep it for last because apparently, like I said, there's a hit in these two packs. So I'm gonna keep these for last and we're gonna start in that order. We're gonna start with Paldea Evolve, one of the latest sets from Scarlet and Violet. We just got Obsidian Flames that just came out with a bunch of Charizards that you could easily pull in my opinion. And we got a little cold card and no card trick on this set. Remember that. Got a little Toys R Us giraffe, Pokeball, Relor, Quaxley, little bird, energy. We got some drugs, reverse hollow, reverse hollow giraffe, and Mimikyu holograph. Palia Evolve is one of them set that I think is gonna end up being really underrated. Has a lot of cool art and the value of it hasn't like skyrocketed or anything. Well, it just came out, but I don't think it's gonna go like crazy like Evo uh, I don't think it's gonna go crazy like Evolving Skies, but in my opinion, 
this set is going to be one of them sets that's underrated in the future. Because the Pokemons that are featured in this set are not like the really popular ones, but I find that the art overall is really nice in this set. And... Ooh, that's what I'm talking about. I always forget this Pokemon exists, and for some reason I find it, I find him cool. Little badass elephant with some nice colors. And, oops, got a little energy. I often say this, but in my opinion, the just regular full art Pokemon cards are probably my favorite ones. Probably alongside with the alternate art. But, I mean, look at the colors on this card. Just beautiful. Anyway, I'm glad we pulled something out of the Scarlet, I mean, the Palvia Evolve sets. Because if these two packs have guaranteed hits, this is going to be a very good box. So let's see if Scarlet and Violet hold something for us too. Here's the co-card. What the hell? I thought like the card here was darker than this one. It looks like it, right? But I think it's just the angle or... No, it is darker. Right? Am I tripping? Whatever. Here is the little albino dick. We got a little... You know those little white dogs that always bark? Reminds me of them. What the heck is that? This looks like if Johnny Bravo turned into a dog or some kind of, I don't know. These Pokemons are weird, man. This is one of my favorite, yeah. This guy is my, probably one of my favorite of the modern Pokemons. This guy is always baked out of his mind, smoking that good. And he's a turtle. If you know me, I like turtles. No pun intended. I like turtles. We got a Scovillain, little pig police officer no i'm joking i respect the good cops out there the good ones keyword Woo! let's freaking go yo this box is loaded and i have the bottom part of this art so now i can connect the two of them together Nice, and I think there's something behind it too. Oh my god. What is that? Oh, I didn't have that. Damn, I thought it was a rainbow rainbow card for a second, because if you look at the bottom there, it's like rainbowish colors, but... Woo! Yo, I'm stoked. This box is loaded. Two hits, two great hits in one pack. All right, we got three packs left, and... This box has been crazy so far. We got it hit in almost every pack. Let's see if Scarlet and Violet can still deliver. At this point, I'm not even mad if there's a regular hollow in this because I'm more satisfied with these three cards than anything else at the moment. Wasn't expecting this box to be this loaded, but here's a co-card for y'all. And what's in the back? I mean in the front. Houndoom little golden retriever little whatever little helmet albino um what's his name anyway sizzlazar reverse hollow reverse hollow douchebag and holographic i'm i don't not even mad i'll take it all right now the moment of truth is there guaranteed hits in the silver tempest packs if there is i'm buying another box tomorrow guaranteed because like yo this has been loaded i don't know if it's just luck but let's see if the rumor is true and if these packs hold any rare cards and man these are so much easier to open than the silver uh scarlet and violet packs feels like more way more cheaper but that's a different era, that's why. And we got the code, uh, not the code card. We got the card trick for this set. Is it four? Man. Yeah. There we go. Guaranteed hit. Let's see. Jinx. Emolga. Chimchimo. Bunnery, whatever his name is. Drowsy. Drunk as hell. Spinarak. Reverse Hollow. And... No way. I've been fooled. Are you serious? 
I've seen so many people open this on YouTube and pull crazy hits out of the Silver Tempest packs and hmm I might be mistaken I don't know but I still got hits from the other set so I'm not really mad you know but let's see if this last pack holds anything last pack magic what the heck hold on what the hell why is the card facing this way the heck I don't okay here's the co-card I'm just I'm not gonna do any tricks now because this is weird usually it's on the other side usually you open the pack and the first card you see is the co-card but hmm okay Lidden Rufflet Duran Duran Reverse hollow. Let's see if there's something in the back first. This dude. Wanna be Raichu. Alright, what's the hit? No way. 